gunshot wounds. He was shot uh, three times, I believe, or three that I identified. Yeah. And we had him identified by fingerprints. So I didn't know him personally. So if it wasn't Tupac Shakur, I don't know who it was. But all the identification we had was authentic. Would it be possible to to uh, fake a coroner's uh, certificate? Oh, anything's possible. But I don't think it was. I sort some things out and I have uh, here a copy of uh, Tupac Shakur's driver's license and that was issued in May that year. And, uh, and it's the official coroner's report. Mm -hmm. And if you compare those two with each other, he, he was, had, had gained 47 pounds in four months. That's really strange, is it? Well, uh, weight on a body is uh, determined by putting the gurney and the decedent on a scale. Yeah. And that scale may or may not be accurate. So sometimes the weight is off, and sometimes the height is off. Uh, an individual standing up is usually shorter than he is when he's lying down. Do you know if there's an official death certificate of Tupac Shakur? Yeah. I have one. You have one, because you issued it. Well, it's kept in our file. Now you have to remember that this file is restricted as far as circulation because it's an open murder. They cremated him already the next day and that's not a normal procedure, is it? Yes, it is. Really? Sure. If the family wants it, that way. This uh, was the photograph of the uh, autopsy of Tupac Shakur. Do you think it would be possible to manipulate a photo in such a way that it would seem real but actually is fake? Absolutely so. Sure. So this could be a fake picture? Uh, could be. I don't think it is. Because I see everything here that uh, I saw at the time of the...